Hello, I'm Daniel, and welcome to the Moon Project. We here at the Moon Project are continuing our series of videos with respect to inspiration, information, uh, education, guidance, advice. And at the time of this recording, uh, Passover is only a, a couple of weeks away. And I'm reminded of something uh, that was said by Rabbi Levi Yitzhak of Berdyshev. He said, uh, how is it that uh, Moshe Rabbeinu, uh, Moses, the prophet, who was so humble and so filled with humility that he tried to talk God out of sending him to Pharaoh? He says, pick somebody else. How was this same person able to, without hesitation, without batting an eye, receive the Torah at Sinai? You know, how does, uh, how does that happen? Didn't hesitate, not for a single second. Rab, uh, Rabbi uh, Levi Yitzhak said that, according to the Medrash, all the mountains of the world came before the Creator and begged to have the schos, the, the honor, the merit of having the Torah given on them. God didn't choose them. He didn't choose Everest. He didn't choose the Alps, the Rockies. He chose Har Sinai. Not a big mountain. Uh, it's rather small. It's, uh, it's not really all that awe-inspiring. And when Moses saw that, that God chose Har Sinai, Mount Sinai of all places, to give the Torah, then he says, okay. Then um, he didn't resist. And he followed the call. Sometimes we view ourselves as being less than what we are. We're not able to do this. I'm not good enough to do this. Whether it's through mod modesty or an improper view of yourself. But um, God doesn't always choose the mighty. Um, for example, uh, when God chose the Jewish people. It's not because we had a great population, a great army. As a matter of fact, the opposite. God said we are the fewest of people to this day. Um, we're a very small group. I sometimes ask people uh, in Canada, Canada and the United States, what percentage of the population do you think is Jewish? Some people will say 5%. Some people will say 10%. Some people say 8%, 12%. Less than 2%. We are the fewest of, pe fewest of people. But, in part because of this, God chose us to be orlegoim, a light unto the nations. It's, a, it's an awesome responsibility. Uh, we have to lead by example. And um, we can't let... Uh, an overdeveloped sense of humility get in the way. Uh, just like Moses, uh, who at first said, you know what, I'm slow of speech and slow of tongue, you better find somebody else for this job, no one's going to listen to me. When it came time for the ultimate honor to be the one to receive the Torah, seeing humble Mount Sinai, it gave him, uh, it gave him strength, he didn't hesitate, he didn't, he didn't uh, put up the argument he did at first. Uh, let's get inspiration from this. Uh, we're going to be doing more videos along these lines. Please come back. Please watch. Please learn. And until next time, on behalf of the Immuno Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you so much.